Actually, the first game, uh, the first system that I actually bought my my stuff. I saved up. Uh, I worked on a train um, as a chef's assistant. Horrible job. <laughs> uh, terrible hours. It's really weird. Anyway, saved up all my tips over the summer, and I bought one, and it was fabulous. <clears throat> um, I think the first game I played was Jack 2, and then the second game I played was the first Jack and Dexter. <laughs> yeah. Um, backwards. I actually got PS2 specifically to play Final Fantasy XI. Oh yeah? I, you know, I never even activated the online capabilities for mine. No, but you didn't, you didn't even have internet in your house, did you? I grew up in the sticks. Boondocks, the boonies. No, no, it doesn't. Oh, wow, he's a different voice, too. No, I don't think so. He's just gotten better at it. <laughs> oh, you look so happy. <laughs> look at the lips on him. Looks like he gets colored, just colored, colored. Thank you. There's another thing I can't do, guys, is pronounce things. A. Nope. I wasn't really even paying attention. <laughs> He looks so different in this game compared to what he is now. Yeah. He was, uh, I always thought he was something of an odd design because um, he's certainly the most human-like character in the game, but I can't decide if he's human or not. Or? Yeah. Oh, I meant Ratchet. Oh, oh yeah. Um. Jesus, this is totally off the, the page there. <laughs> well, I mean, I don't think he was a human because he's only got the three fingers. Well, I mean, that could be a birth defect, like the penguin. Well, could be, but... Did I miss anything? Oh, I, I did. Right there. Oops. Sorry? Right? No, the gray part. Oh, yeah? Well... Okay, I think I know where... Stop that! I you stop it. it. Um, uh, yeah, Ratchet's design. Um, here he's meant to look young with the big head and the big hands. And, uh, they tried to make him look older in the other games, like he's matured. Okay. Yeah. Bing bong. Yeah, the series did. Um, some, it's something that I think is really cool, and I wish that they would do it in more series, but I understand why they don't. And that's that in the second one, if you have if you have a save file from the first game, you can start off with all of the weapons that you had from the first game. And 
I understand why they don't do that in most games, like Zelda games, because if you already have everything, what's the point of playing the game? You, know? you play the game, you kind of go through and collect everything. Which is usually why I don't play a, a, a new game plus, mm -hmm. um, unless I've got weapons to level uh, or things that I haven't finished in the first one, because I just don't find it challenging enough, and I just breeze right through it, and it's no fun. But I still think that it was just really a really fun thing to do, and it added a sense of uh, connectedness between the two, you know? Sure. It made them made it seem like they were in a real world. Um, it was something that actually also happened in Patafons, um, Patafons and Patafon Two, which is a game that I would love to stream. You think point. people would be able to put up with it? I don't know. Um, it's pretty awesome. It's pretty That's cute. It is. It's adorable. I don't know about you, but um, I could just keep listening to that music. I might not be able to come here yet. Oh, there we go. I didn't think it would let me die. Air. Look at that oxygen tanky thingy. Looks like there are viruses inside of it. Can I come in here? Okay. I think that's a pretty neat um, visual for it because it kind of really represents your uh, your blood oxygen level. <laughs> sure. The third tank? Where's your third tank? Dive, you. Dive, dive. Alright. It'll be fun when I get my mask and I can just breathe through the water. Neat. Mask and the, uh, the the rotor thing. I think it comes the it all comes at the same time. Well, that would certainly make sense. I hope so. So. Obviously, we're going to do this playthrough on Twitch, and we're going to load that on uh, on YouTube in, in parts. Later um, on, yeah. Later on. Um, are we going... What do you think about doing, um, like, like once we finish the game, like, doing a review? Like a five-minute review? Did we decide that we're going to do that? Maybe. I don't know if I have the oral skills for that. Why did I go through there? Was there a point... The I guess. Stop! My Let goodness! The stars go there with that. Uh, I think that's that my ship. ship. Okay. Yeah, because I've got coordinates for two different planets right now. You mean like doing like a fully edited, here's the review? Yeah, like. Scripted and stuff? Yeah, like actually scripting it. Um, that would be fun yeah, after the game. Like, hey, what did you guys actually think of it? Yeah. You know, is this where we are now? I usually just go down the list. Also, are we going to? Let's say we play we play a game that we haven't played before. Yeah. Um. Are we going to try to finish it? Well. I would think that we would try to finish it, but are we gonna bother, like, streaming all the time that we're leveling up, or looking for specific items? That we well, I mean, we'll we'll stream when we're playing, but the stuff on YouTube could potentially be edited for time. Cool. Or we gotta play all that stuff anyway, and might as well stream it. That's oh, true. I wish I hadn't done so that. So that all of you lovely people can watch. Hi, lovely people.
Right. <laughs> I just keep pressing um, circle instead of triangle, which is playing the briefing thing, playing the videos.